about death. I'm gonna need some help. Ladies and gentlemen, I know exactly what you're thinking. Ryan, why are you doing a vlog today? Didn't you say your next vlog was on Tuesday? Yes, yes I did. I did say the next vlog was on Tuesday and that is for the Lost City. That's on Tuesday, that's still happening. But today, I saw a movie being advertised and I was like, you know what? This movie is directed by Michael Bay. Who doesn't love a Michael Bay movie? So welcome ladies and gentlemen to this vlog. Now tonight we are off to see a movie called Ambulance. And yes, the sun is directly in my face. That's why my face is like squinted. <laughs> but we're off to see a movie called Ambulance, which is a heist movie. And it stars Jake Gyllenhaal, who you might remember from Spider-Man, Far From Home, he was Mysterio. Quentin Beck. The guy who was in The Matrix, the guy who said, you know, the red pill or the blue pill, he's in this movie, but I can't remember, you know, the main guy's, the actor's name. I can't remember his name. And Vex Sims, who is the guy from Paul Blart's Mall Cop, he's also in this movie. Those are the three actors that I recognize. Ignore the sun directly behind me those are the three actors that i know in this movie and i know what you're thinking ryan didn't you upload earlier today yes i did i uploaded my custom guy with his entrance his signature his finisher victory scene you know all the generic stuff why didn't you do it on the gaming channel well i wanted to do it on my main channel because you know it is me in the game I know you guys probably can't see me. I can't even see myself in the reflection. <laughs> so, let's say this is a heist movie that we're going to see. And as I say, it's directed by Michael Bay. I love Michael Bay movies, explosions. Those, those are like the main things you get with a Michael Bay movie. Any movie that has, you know, loads of explosions. That's Michael Bay. He did that. <laughs> Random cat just staring at me. Hello there. <laughs> uh, we're not far from the Obi-Wan Kenobi series. Just saying that line. I'm ready. I, I don't know about you, but I'm ready for the Obi-Wan Kenobi series on May 25th. But ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end this little section, you know, just to let my arm die. <laughs> but I will see you in a second because it's nice weather which is an advantage but i know you guys you cannot see me even if i cover up the, the, the sun is impossible i can't do it i can't do it Ladies and gentlemen, one word to describe this movie. Explosions. That, that is the only way to describe this movie. So, there wasn't many people in this movie. It wasn't advertised. Did I just die? <laughs> There wasn't advertised as well as, you know, other movies would have been. <clears throat> oh, but man, this movie, ladies and gentlemen, delivered on every explosion, every bullet shot. This movie, it reminds me of the Marine movies. If you remember the Marine movies, the ones with John Cena... I think Randy Orton was one of the Miz. Miz was one of the Marines. And my favorite Marine movie is definitely the Marine 5. I love that one. And this one give me that vibe. Because it involved an ambulance 
just like this movie. So, spoilers ahead. Here's your jobber warning. Two brothers, Will and Danny. Will has to pay for surgery for his wife. And he goes on this heist with his brother, Danny. And it's supposed to go simple. But it doesn't. And it leads to this whole five-star Grand Theft Auto <laughs> chase that leads into the sewers. The guy from Mall Cop is one of the FBI agents. And he's called Agent Clark. And he's gay. There was also a EMP, or not an EMP, um, like a ambulance person woman. Her name was Cam. And I actually didn't know that she was in the movie Bloodshot. If you remember, we saw Bloodshot quite a while back. That was like 2020. Before the cinemas actually closed, I went to see Bloodshot, which was Vin Diesel. But after the heist still goes to hell, Will ends up getting shot. And then he ends up shooting Danny. And Danny ends up dying. And Will ends up living because he saved a cop's life. And he saved a paramedic. That's that's the term. She's a paramedic. So he was able to live. And you know support his family. Now. There's a movie that I'm seeing tomorrow. It's a DreamWorks. Movie. And it's called. The Bad Guys. I'm not vlogging. For it. So don't be expecting a vlog tomorrow. My next vlog is on Tuesday and that is for the Lost City. Nothing's changing there. But ladies and gentlemen, that uh, I know you weren't expecting a vlog today, tonight, but hey ho, you got one and I'm thankful that I did go to see pff, I'm thankful that I did go to see this movie. There were moments where I was sitting forward and if you know from my previous vlogs, when I start sitting forward, I'm really invested in these movies. And I'll be like, oh, 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 God. You know, when something happens, I'm that guy to deliver commentary when the explosions happen. So I thoroughly enjoyed this. And would I watch it again? Hell yes. Hell yeah, I would watch this movie again because it is really fucking good so ladies and gentlemen thank you for watching if you did watch the first half of this vlog i apologize for the sun i i i, I, I can't do anything about the sun okay i can't control the weather we've had good weather the last couple of days but i can't do anything if it is you know sun in the sky and it's shining directly behind me I can't do anything about that. Oh, walk a different way, Ryan. No, I'm dedicated to what ways I walk. I like to shake it up a bit. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching and I will see you all on Tuesday. Yes, I did just call you a cunt. That's not like me. You're so mean, Ryan.